Nomenclature of Inorganic Chemistry, IUPAC Recommendations 2005 is the 2005 version of Nomenclature of Inorganic Chemistry which is informally called the Red Book. It is a collection of rules for naming inorganic compounds, as recommended by the International Union of Pure and Applied Chemistry IUPAC. Summary The 2005 edition replaces their previous recommendations nomenclature the Red Book of Inorganic Chemistry, IUPAC Recommendations 1990 Red Book 1, and where appropriate SIC nomenclature of Inorganic Chemistry 2, IUPAC Recommendations 2000 Red Book 2. The recommendations take up over 300 pages and the full text can be downloaded from IUPAC. Corrections have been issued. Apart from a reorganization of the content, there is a new section on organometallics and a formal element list to be used in place of electronegativity lists in sequencing elements in formulae and names. The concept of a preferred IUPAC name, PIN, a part of the revised Blue Book for organic compound naming, has not yet been adopted for inorganic compounds. There are, however, guidelines as to which naming method should be adopted. Topic. Naming methods The recommendations describe a number of different ways in which compounds can be named. These are Compositional naming e.g. sodium chloride Substitutive naming based on parent hydrides germanium chloride me 2 dichlorodimethylgermane Additive naming manganese 3 hypofluorite fluorodotrioxidomanganese Additionally there are recommendations for the following Naming of cluster compounds Allowed names for inorganic acids and derivatives Naming of solid phases e.g. Non-stoichiometric phases for a simple compound such as aluminium chloride The different naming conventions yield the following Compositional, aluminium trichloride stoichiometrically, or dialuminium hexachloride dimer. Substitutional, trichloralumane Additive, trichloridaluminium, hexachlorododialuminium dimer without structural information, dimuchloride OTETRACHLORIDO 1 kappa 2 Cl, 2 kappa 2 Cl dialuminium dimer with structural information. Topic. Sequencing elements The electronegativity list Throughout the recommendations the use of the electronegativity of elements for sequencing has been replaced by a formal list which is loosely based on electronegativity. The recommendations still use the terms electropositive and electronegative to refer to an element's relative position in this list. A simple rule of thumb ignoring lanthanides and actinides is for two elements in different groups, then the element in the higher numbered group has higher electronegativity. For two elements within the same group the element with the lower the atomic number has the higher electronegativity. Hydrogen is fitted in to be less electronegative than any chalcogen and more electronegative than any panectogen. Hence the formulae of water and ammonia can be written H2O and NH3 respectively, the full list, from highest to lowest, electronegativity, with the addition of elements 112 through 118, that had not yet been named in 2005, to their respective groups. Group 17 in atomic number sequence i.e. FTS followed by Group 16 in atomic number sequence i.e. OLV followed by H, hydrogen, followed by Group 15 in atomic number sequence i.e. NMC followed by Group 14 in atomic number sequence i.e. C Florida followed by Group 13 in atomic number sequence i.e. BNH followed by Group 12 in atomic number sequence i.e. Zinc CN followed by Group 11 in atomic number sequence i.e. CURG followed by Group 10 in atomic number sequence i.e. Nidis followed by Group 9 in atomic number sequence i.e. Co-mount followed by 
Group 8 in atomic number sequence i.e. Fe H is followed by Group 7 in atomic number sequence i.e. Minnesota BH followed by Group 6 in atomic number sequence i.e. CRSG followed by Group 5 in atomic number sequence i.e. VD flat followed by Group 4 in atomic number sequence i.e. TRF followed by Group 3 in atomic number sequence i.e. SCY followed by The lanthanoids in atomic number sequence i.e. Le Lu followed by The actinoids in atomic number sequence i.e. ACLR followed by Group 2 in atomic number sequence i.e. BRA followed by Group 1 excluding H in atomic number sequence i.e. Li FR followed by Group 18 in atomic number sequence i.e. HEOG Determining the nomenclature to use Note. Treat separately means to use the decision table on each component. Topic: Element names. Topic: Sample of indeterminate structure. An indeterminate sample simply takes the element name. For example a sample of carbon which could be diamond graphite etc or a mixture would be named carbon Topic <laughs> specific allotrope Topic <laughs> <laughs> molecular O2 dioxygen acceptable name oxygen O3 trioxygen acceptable name ozone P4 tetraphosphorus acceptable name white phosphorus S6 hexasulfur acceptable name epsilon sulfur S8 cyclooctosulfur acceptable names for the polymorphic forms are alpha sulfur beta sulfur gamma sulfur topic <laughs> crystalline form This is specified by the element symbol followed by the Pearson symbol for the crystal form. Note that the recommendations specifically italicize the second character. CN carbon CF8 acceptable name diamond. SNN tin T4 acceptable name beta or white tin. MNN manganese C58 acceptable name alpha manganese. Topic Amorphous recognized allotropes Examples include PN, red phosphorus, ASN, amorphous arsenic Compounds Compositional names impart little structural information and are recommended for use when structural information is not available or does not need to be conveyed. Stoichiometric names are the simplest and reflect either the empirical formula or the molecular formula. The ordering of the elements follows the formal electronegativity list for binary compounds and electronegativity list to group the elements into two classes which are then alphabetically sequenced. The proportions are specified by di, tri, etc. CIUPAC numerical multiplier, where there are known to be complex cations or anions these are named in their own right and then these names used as part of the compound name. <laughs> Binary compounds In binary compounds the more electropositive element is placed first in the formula. The formal list is used. The name of the most electronegative element is modified to end in ide and the more electropositive element's name is left unchanged. Taking the binary compound of sodium and chlorine, chlorine is found first in the list so therefore comes last in the name. Other examples are Phosphorus pentachloride Phosphorus pentachloride Calcium phosphide decalcium triphosphide NISN nickel stannide 
CR23C6 trichosochromium hexacarbide. Topic: <laughs> Ternary compounds and beyond. The following illustrate the principles. The 1 to 1, 1 to 1 quaternary compound between bromine, chlorine, iodine, and phosphorus PBrCli phosphorus bromide chloride iodide phosphorus is the most electropositive, the others are all designated as electronegative and are sequenced alphabetically. The ternary 2, 1 to 5 compound of antimony, copper, and potassium can be named in two ways depending on which elements are designated as electronegative. CUK5 SB2 copper pentapotassium diantimonide. Both copper and potassium are designated as electropositive and are sequenced alphabetically. K5 copper 6 antimonide pentapotassium diantimonide cupride. Only potassium is designated as electropositive and the two electronegative elements are sequenced alphabetically. Note the red book shows this example incorrectly. Topic Naming of ions and radicals Cations Monatomic cations are named by taking the element name and following it with the charge in brackets e.g. Na plus sodium Cr3 plus chromium 3 plus sometimes an abbreviated form of the element name has to be taken, e.g. germid for germanium as germanide refers to Ge-3. Polyatomic cations of the same element are named as the element name preceded by di, tri, etc., e.g. Hg2 plus 2 dimercury 2 plus polyatomic cations made up of different elements are named either substitutively or additively, e.g. PH plus 4 phosphanium SBF plus 4 tetrafluorostabanium substitutive or tetrafluoroantimony 1 plus Note that ammonium and oxonium are acceptable names for NH plus 4 and H3O plus respectively Hydronium is not an acceptable name for H3O plus Topic <laughs> anions Monatomic anions are named as the element modified with an ide ending. The charge follows in brackets, optional for 1 minus e.g. Cl minus chloride 1 minus or chloride S2 minus sulfide 2 minus. Some elements take their Latin name as the root e.g. Silver, ag, argentide Copper, cu, cupride Iron, fe, ferride Tin, Sn, standard polyatomic anions of the same element are named as the element name preceded by di, tri, etc., e.g. O22 minus dioxide or peroxide as an acceptable name. C22 minus dicarbide or acetylide as an acceptable name. S22 minus disulfide or sometimes as an alternative derived from a substitutive name, e.g. S22 minus disulfane dipolyatomic anions made up of different elements are named either substitutively or additively. The name endings are ID and 8 respectively, e.g. germanium hydride minus germanide, substitutive, or trihydride germinate, 1 minus additive. TEH3 minus telenaud substitutive, where UIDE specifies anion composed of additional hydride attached to parent hydride. PF6 minus hexafluoro lambda 5 phosphonude substitutive or hexafluorodophosphate 1 minus additive SO32 minus trioxidosulfate 2 minus additive or sulfite acceptable non-systematic name a full list of the alternative acceptable non-systematic names for cations and anions is in the recommendations Many anions have names derived from inorganic acids and these are dealt with later Topic. Radicals The presence of unpaired electrons can be indicated by a quote quote. For example, He plus helium plus N2 2 2, 2 plus dinitrogen 2 2 plus. 
Topic: <laughs> Naming of hydrates and similar lattice compounds. The use of the term hydrate is still acceptable e.g. sodium sulfate 10H2O, sodium sulfate decahydrate. The recommended method would be to name it sodium sulfate water 1 Similarly other examples of lattice compounds are calcium chloride 8NH3, calcium chloride ammonia 1 8 2 sodium carbonate 3H2O2, sodium carbonate hydrogen peroxide 2 thirds, aluminium chloride 4ETOH, aluminium chloride ethanol 1 quarter. Topic. Specifying proportions using charge or oxidation state As an alternative to dye, tri prefixes either charge or oxidation state can be used. Charge is recommended as oxidation state may be ambiguous and open to debate. Topic. Substitutive nomenclature This naming method generally follows established IUPAC organic nomenclature. Hydrides of the main group elements groups 13 to 17 are given AIN base names, e.g. borane, BH3. Acceptable alternative names for some of the parent hydrides are water rather than oxidane and ammonia rather than azane. In these cases the base name is intended to be used for substituted derivatives. This section of the recommendations covers the naming of compounds containing rings and chains. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Base hydrides. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Hydrides with non-standard bonding. Lambda convention Where a compound has non-standard bonding as compared to the parent hydride for example phosphorus pentachloride the lambda convention is used. For example, phosphorus pentachloride pentachloro lambda 5 phosphane SF6 hexafluoro lambda 6 sulfane Polynuclear hydrides A prefix di, tri etc. is added to the parent hydride name. Examples are HOOH, dioxidane hydrogen peroxide is an acceptable name H2PPH2, diphosphane H3 cis 2 silicon hydride silicon hydride, tetrasilane Topic. Rings and chains The recommendations describe three ways of assigning «parent» names to homonuclear monocyclic hydrides i.e. single rings consisting of one element The Hanch-Widman nomenclature the method preferred for rings of size 3 to 10. Skeletal replacement nomenclature Specifying the replacement of carbon atoms in the corresponding carbon compound with atoms of another element e.g. silicon becomes sila, germanium, germa and a multiplicative prefix tri, tetra, penta etc. the method preferred for rings greater than 10 by adding the prefix cyclo to the name of the corresponding unbranched, unsubstituted chain. Boron hydrides The stoichiometric name is followed by the number of hydrogen atoms in brackets. For example B2H6, deborane 6. More structural information can be conveyed by adding the structural descriptor, closo, nido, arachno, hypho, clado prefixes. There is a fully systematic method of numbering the atoms in the boron hydride clusters, and a method of describing the position of bridging hydrogen atoms using the mu symbol. <laughs> Main group organometallic compounds 
Use of substitutive nomenclature is recommended for group 13 to 16 main group organometallic compounds. Examples are Aluminium hydride Me named methylalumane Bismuth 2 iodide pH named diiodo phenyl bismuthane for organometallic compounds of groups 1 to 2 can use additive indicating a molecular aggregate or compositional naming Examples are Beth named ethyl hydridoberyllium or ethanida hydridoberyllium Mg 8-5C5H5-2 named bis 8-5-cyclopentadienyl magnesium or bis 8-5-cyclopentadienido magnesium Na CHCH2 sodium ethanide compositional name however the recommendation notes that future nomenclature projects will be addressing these compounds topic <inaudible> <inaudible> additive nomenclature this naming has been developed principally for coordination compounds although it can be more widely applied examples are Silicon hydroxide tetrahydroxidosilicon additive, or silanotetrol substitutive note silicic acid is an acceptable name. Orthosilicic has been dropped. Cobalt 1 chloride NH3 5 Cl2 pentaminochloride cobalt 2 plus chloride. Topic: <laughs> Recommended procedure for naming mononuclear compounds. The recommendations include a flow chart which can be summarized very briefly. Identify the central atom. Identify and name the ligands. Specify coordination mode of ligands i.e. using kappa and or eta conventions. Sequence the ligands. Specify coordination geometry i.e. polyhedral symbol, configuration index using CIP rules and absolute configuration for optically active compounds. Topic. Ligand names Topic. Anionic ligands If the anion name ends in ide then as a ligand its name is changed to end in O. For example the chloride anion, Cl- becomes chlorido. This is a difference from organic compound naming and substitutive naming where chlorine is treated as neutral and it becomes chloro, as in phosphorus trichloride, which can be named as either substitutively or additively as trichlorophosphane or trichloridophosphorus respectively. Similarly if the anion names end in ite, ate then the ligand names are ito, ato. Neutral ligands. Neutral ligands do not change name with the exception of the following Water aqua, Ammonia amine, Carbon monoxide bonded via carbon carbonyl, Nitrogen monoxide bonded via nitrogen nitrosyl. Topic. Examples of ligand names Topic. Sequence and position of ligands and central atoms Ligands are ordered alphabetically by name and precede the central atom name. The number of ligands coordinating is indicated by the prefixes di, tri, tetra penta etc. for simple ligands or bis, tris, tetrakis, etc. for complex ligands. For example, Cobalt 1 chloride NH3 5 Cl2 pentamina chloride cobalt 3 plus chloride where amine NH3 precedes chloride. The central atom names come after the ligands. Where there is more than one central atom, it is preceded by di tri, tetra, etc. Os3 CO12 dodecacarbonyl triosmium where there are different central atoms, they are sequenced using the electronegativity list. Reco CO9 nonacarbonylrhenium cobalt. Topic: <inaudible> <inaudible> Bridging ligands. 
Use of mu symbol Ligands may bridge two or more centers. The prefix mu is used to specify a bridging ligand in both the formula and the name. For example the dimeric form of aluminium trichloride Aluminium chloride mu Cl 2 di mu chloride O T E T R A C H L O R I D O 1 kappa 2 Cl 2 kappa 2 Cl di aluminium This example illustrates the ordering of bridging and non-bridging ligands of the same type. In the formula the bridging ligands follow the non-bridging whereas in the name the bridging ligands precede the non-bridging. Note the use of the kappa convention to specify that there are two terminal chlorides on each aluminium. Topic: <inaudible> Bridging index. Where there are more than two centers that are bridged, a bridging index is added as a subscript. For example, in basic beryllium acetate, which can be visualized as a tetrahedral arrangement of B atoms linked by six acetate ions forming a cage with a central oxide anion, the formula and name are as follows: B4 mu 4 o mu o 2 CME 6 hexakis mu acetato kappa o kappa o mu 4 oxido tetrahedra tetraberyllium mu 4 describes the bridging of the central oxide ion. Note the use of the kappa convention to describe the bridging of the acetate ion where both oxygen atoms are involved. In the name where a ligand is involved in different modes of bridging, the multiple bridging is listed in decreasing order of complexity, e.g. mu 3 bridging before mu 2 bridging. Kappa, Kappa, convention The Kappa convention is used to specify which ligand atoms are bonding to the central atom and in polynuclear species which atoms, both bridged and unbridged, link to which central atom. For monodentate ligands there is no ambiguity as to which atom is forming the bond to the central atom. However when a ligand has more than one atom that can link to a central atom the kappa convention is used to specify which atoms in a ligand are forming a bond. The element atomic symbol is italicized and preceded by kappa, kappa. These symbols are placed after the portion of the ligand name that represents the ring, chain etc. where the ligand is located. For example, Pentaminonitrito kappa O cobalt 3 specifies that the nitrite ligand is linking via the oxygen atom ferry there is more than one bond formed from a ligand by a particular element a numerical superscript gives the count. For example, aqua ethane 1 2 dialdinitrilo kappa 2 n in tris acetato kappa O acetato cobalt 8 1 the cobalt anion formed with water and pentadentate edta which links via two nitrogen atoms and three oxygen atoms there are two bonds from nitrogen atoms in edta which is specified by kappa 2 n in the three bonds from oxygen are specified by tris acetato kappa o, where there is one ligation per acetate. In polynuclear complexes, the use of the kappa symbol is extended in two related ways. Firstly, to specify which ligating atoms bind to which central atom, and secondly, to specify for a bridging ligand which central atoms are involved. The central atoms must be identified, i.e., by assigning numbers to them. This is formally dealt with in the recommendations. To specify which ligating atoms in a ligand link to which central atom, the central atom numbers precede the kappa symbol, and numerical superscript specifies the number of ligations and this is followed by the atomic symbol. Multiple occurrences are separated by commas. Examples Dimu chloride OTETRACHLORIDO 1 kappa 2 Cl, 2 kappa 2 Cl dialuminium, aluminium trichloride. TETRACHLORIDO 1 kappa 2 Cl, 2 kappa 2 Cl specifies that there are two chloride ligands on each aluminium atom. DECACARBONYL 1 kappa 3 C, 2 kappa 3 C, 3 kappa 4 C di mu hydrido minus 1 to 2 kappa 2 H, 1 to 2 kappa 2 H triangulo 3 os os decacarbonyl dihydridotriasmium. DECACARBONYL 1 kappa 3 C, 2 kappa 3 C, 3 kappa 4 C shows that there are three carbonyl groups on two osmium atoms and four on the third. 
di mu hydrido minus one to two kappa two h one to two kappa two h specifies that the two hydride bridge between the osmium atom one and osmium atom two. Topic eta eta convention. The use of eta to denote hapticity is systematized. The use of eta one is not recommended. When the specification of the atoms involved is ambiguous the position of the atoms must be specified. This is illustrated by the examples Cr C6H62 named as bis benzene chromium as all of the contiguous atoms in the benzene ligands are involved their position does not have to be specified 1, 2, 5, 6 eta CYCLOOCTA1, 3, 5, 7 tetraene eta 5 cyclopentadienyl cobalt in this only two at positions 1 and 5 of the four double bonds are linked to the central atom. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Coordination geometry. For any coordination number above two more than one coordination geometry is possible. For example four coordinate coordination compounds can be tetrahedral, square planar, square pyramidal or seesaw shaped. The polyhedral symbol is used to describe the geometry. A configuration index is determined from the positions of the ligands and together with the polyhedral symbol is placed at the beginning of the name. For example in the complex sp43 acetonitrile dichlorido pyridine platinum 2 the sp43 at the beginning of the name describes a square planar geometry for coordinate with a configuration index of 3 indicating the position of the ligands around the central atom For more detail see polyhedral symbol Topic <laughs> organometallic groups 3 to 12 Additive nomenclature is generally recommended for organometallic compounds of groups 3 to 12 transition metals and zinc, cadmium and mercury. Topic: <laughs> Metallocenes. Following on from ferrocene, the first sandwich compound with a central Fe atom coordinated to two parallel cyclopentadienyl rings Names for compounds with similar structures such as osmocene and vanadocene are in common usage. The recommendation is that the name ending ocene should be restricted to compounds where there are discrete molecules of bis metal and ring substituted analogues, where the cyclopentadienyl rings are essentially parallel, and the metal is in the D block. The terminology does not apply to compounds of the S or P block elements such as bar C5H5-2 or SN C5H5-2. Examples of compounds that meet the criteria are vanadocene V A to 5 C5H5-2, chromocene Cr A to 5 C5H5-2, cobortocene Co A to 5 C5H5-2. Rhodocene, RH, A to 5 C5 H5 2 Nicelacine, Ni, A to 5 C5 H5 2 Ruthenocene, Ru, A to 5 C5 H5 2 Osmocene, Os, A to 5 C5 H5 2 Manganocene, Minnesota, A to 5 C5 H5 2 Renocene, Re, A to 5 C5 H5 2 Examples of compounds that should not be named as metallocenes are C10H10T T A5C5H52Cl2 is properly named dichloridobus A5Cyclopentadienyl titanium not titanocene dichloride Topic <laughs> Polynuclear cluster compounds Metal–metal bonds In polynuclear compounds with metal–metal bonds these are shown after the element name as follows 3-os-os in decacarbonyl dihydridotriosmium 
a pair of brackets contain a count of the bonds formed if greater than 1, followed by the italicized element atomic symbols separated by an M dash. Polynuclear cluster geometry The geometries of polynuclear clusters can range in complexity. A descriptor e.g. tetrahedra or the set descriptor e.g. td delta 4 closo can be used. This is determined by the complexity of the cluster. Some examples are shown below of descriptors and SEP equivalents. The set descriptors are named for Casey, Evans and Powell who described the system. Examples Decacarbonyl demanganese Bis pentacarbonyl manganese Minnesota Minnesota Dodecacarbonyl tetraodium Trimu carbonyl minus 1 to 2 kappa 2 C 1 to 3 kappa 2 C 2 to 3 kappa 2 C nonacarbonyl 1 kappa 2 C 2 kappa 2 C 3 kappa 2 C 4 kappa 3 C TD 13 delta 4 closo tetraodium 6 RH RH or trimu carbonyl minus 1 to 2 kappa 2 C 1 to 3 kappa 2 C 2 to 3 kappa 2 C nonacarbonyl 1 kappa 2 C 2 kappa 2 C 3 kappa 2 C 4 kappa 3 C tetrahedra tetraodium 6 RH RH Topic: Inorganic acids. Topic: Hydrogen names. The recommendations include a description of hydrogen names for acids. The following examples illustrate the method: HNO3 hydrogen nitrate, H2SO4 dihydrogen sulfate. HSO4 minus hydrogen sulfate 2 minus H2S dihydrogen sulfide note that the difference from the compositional naming method hydrogen sulfide as in hydrogen naming there is no space between the electropositive and electronegative components this method gives no structural information regarding the position of the hydrons hydrogen atoms if this information is to be conveyed then the additive name should be used see the list below for examples topic <laughs> list of acceptable names the recommendations give a full list of acceptable names for common acids and related anions a selection from this list is shown below topic solids stoichiometric phases are named compositionally non stoichiometric phases are more difficult where possible formulae should be used but where necessary naming such as the following may be used iron 2 sulfide iron deficient molybdenum dicarbide carbon excess topic Mineral names Generally mineral names should not be used to specify chemical composition. However a mineral name can be used to specify the structure type in a formula e.g. Barium titanate perovskite type Approximate formulae and variable composition A simple notation may be used where little information on the mechanism for variability is either available or is not required to be conveyed. Tilde fez circa or approximately where there is a continuous range of composition this can be written e.g. k bridge cl for a mixture of kbr and kcl and li2 mg cl2 for a mixture of lithium chloride and magnesium chloride. The recommendation is to use the following generalized method e.g. Cuckney 1 minus X for CU Ni KBRX CL 1 minus X for K bridge CL note that cation vacancies in Ku could be described by cobalt 2 oxide minus X 
Topic: Point defects Kroger-Vink notation. Point defects, site symmetry and site occupancy can all be described using Kroger-Vink notation. Note that the IUPAC preference is for vacancies to be specified by V rather than V, the element vanadium. Topic: <laughs> Phase nomenclature. To specify the crystal form of a compound or element, the Pearson symbol may be used. The use of «structurbericht» e.g. A1 etc. or Greek letters is not acceptable. The Pearson symbol may be followed by the space group and the prototype formula. Examples are Carbon CF8, Diamond Ruel CP22, PM3 m, Cesium chloride type Polymorphism It is recommended that polymorphs are identified, e.g. for ZNS where the two forms zinc blende cubic and vertsite hexagonal as ZNS C and ZNS H respectively. Topic: Notes and references. <laughs>